ready? Yeah. Sit down. You you guys bring oh, the tube up? I got this up front. Get the tube up. And the line. Get out there. Should we throw the tube up? Oh, I can't hold it. Right. Right now. What's good? Look, no hands! I was just out on the little life boat, whatever. What's the thing called that we're pulling? The tube? Like a little drift tube or whatever. You pull it behind the boat. But I couldn't get a video of it because if I had a handle for my GoPro, I guess I could have recorded myself. But I haven't bought one of those yet. I really need to invest in one. Because I have the GoPro, I just don't have the handle. I've gone through like four of those things. I need to just find a good quality one and stick with it. Having fun yet? My aunt and uncle just drove down here and bought this boat, so we decided to utilize it, you know, by coming out to, I don't remember. What's this lake called? Lake of the Pines? Lake of the Pines down in Jefferson, Texas, uh, right by Longview. So we actually came out here a long time ago, but he just borrowed one of his friend's boats and he just came and bought this one. It's pretty cool so far. It's only making my dad want a boat even more, which I don't remember a time when he wasn't looking for a boat. Well, you're gonna have to get wet if you're gonna come over here. Come over where? Not you, Christopher.
Music sounds like Pixar, honestly. It's reminding me of like Toy Story and stuff. We're out here on this raft and stuff. Got some cool. Whoop, oh, I'm gonna fall. We got some really cool drone videos and stuff. So hopefully that all comes together. Uh, it was kind of scary though because flying the drone stuff over water is. But that's not scary enough. I'm having to land it in this boat and. Uh, so I'm over here trying to balance it and it's got all this detective stuff making sure I don't run into anything. So it's moving, the boat's moving, I'm trying to land it. I don't want it to go in the water, I don't want the propellers to hit anything and it was, it was overall, it was risky business but it all worked out in the end. So Now we're just out here with this really slow music that's probably going to give me a copyright claim. Two 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 you said go fast and hard so you flip off? No! I'll flip you off if you do! Okay! My turn and uh, mom offered to record for me so hopefully she don't drop my camera. Hopefully you're in focus because I don't have my glasses on. It should be autofocus. Excellent. And facial recognition. I don't know why you use manual focus for everything. My face is always focused. Oh no! Uh -oh. The fuel pump is bad! <laughs>
that was pretty much my day. Um, yeah, I've been kind of busy working on the Jeep and stuff, and I was going to make an update, but I'm really focused on getting all that done. I am going to be leaving sometime either this week. No, it's the end of this. Yeah, no, probably, probably early next week. So I will start uploading more consistently then. I'm just working on a couple more things real fast. Um, I got a lot of stuff done to the Jeep. And I was, I was really thinking about updating you guys, but I think I'm just going to wait till I'm actually out on the trip, spend some more time with family. I also had one week where I was just like completely down, like completely out of it and stuff. Definitely going to be on the road really soon. I just kind of wanted to make this quick video today because I wanted to play with my drone and stuff, get it over the water, kind of explore actually, you know, being out in nature and stuff was really cool to just, you know, get to use my gear for what I've been using it for. You know, got to test out my backpack and everything, which held up great, by the way and then, you know, just flying the drone. So overall, it was a fun day. Just kind of wanted to boost this one out. I don't know if it's gonna be interesting, but I think it's gonna be cool. Before I go though, I just wanna give a huge thank you to a new Patreon pledge. Chris Rickard, thank you so much for the new Patreon pledge. Chris Rickard, I think I said that right. He actually said that he lived in a sheep for uh, last summer, so that was probably really cool. And so yeah, he became a new Patreon pledge and that was awesome, thank you so much. Uh, any support I can get, I really appreciate. If anyone wants to become a Patreon pledge, link is down below. So anyway, that's actually all I have for you today. And yeah, really excited to start this trip. Just gotta work out a couple more things and I'll up you, I'll update you guys as soon as I get out there. Also, huge thank you to Bruce Jividen. Um, he actually bought me tacos the other day and it was awesome. Yeah.